So my name is Joe Gunter and I'm the town manager in Fairhaven, Vermont. Uh, Fairhaven, Vermont was established in 1779. So this year in 2019, we're celebrating our 240th anniversary. Uh, and Fairhaven has all the amenities that you, you would expect from a 200-year-old uh, community in New England. Uh, but it also has some, some kind of quirky amenities that, that you wouldn't expect to find. Uh, to start, where we are here in, in, on the town green, our town green is about six and a half acres uh, in size, one of the, making it one of the largest greens in Vermont, and is one of only 150 left in the state. So uh, it's, it's a pretty unique location. Uh, here in town, uh, some folks don't, don't realize we have a lot going on in Fairhaven for being such a small community. Uh, every Thursday we have uh, concerts in the park in the summer, uh, which is open to the public. Some pretty great bands show up. Uh, if you come to town on Fridays, you can also take part in, in some events like a chili cook-off uh, or cor cornhole tournaments that we're having. Uh, and just kind of, or if, if that's not your speed, just hang out and have lunch. The, the, town, the town green is a wonderful spot to uh, just bring the family and hang out with a picnic, have a picnic. Other amenities the, that the town has that, you know, right across the street from the town green, uh, our little hidden treasure is the Fairhaven Free Library. This library is, uh, was established in 1908 with a $8,000 donation from Andrew Carnegie and one is one of only four Carnegie libraries uh, in the state of Vermont. Uh, the library, to really get the true experience, you have to go into the library, uh, walk past the, uh, the librarian at the front desk, and uh, get underneath the uh, rotunda there. It's an amazing spot with some great acoustics, beautiful architecture, columns. It's, it's not what you'd expect to see in small town Vermont. Uh, it has a be beautiful mosaic flooring that is just, it's, it's a unique and a real historical treasure uh, for the entire country.